Hello guys, and it's Sean Fade 2 back in a brand new video. Today is why I think Dot 2 at Christmas doesn't really work. Now, if you know us guys, throughout the years, the Dot 2 Christmas specials are getting less and less good. They sort of free goodly. Well, they were good, and then I think they went like up and down. Up and down, yeah, up and down. And then I think as soon as um, maybe you can count the end of Time Part 1 because it wasn't really Christmassy. But then again, that wasn't really a problem. It went straight down with um, a Christmas Carol. I didn't like Christmas Carol myself. People love Christmas Carol. And then it went even further down because I don't believe it was, you know, Christmas Carol was any gooder than any David Tate's Christmas ones. And then it went um, very further down. And then Pierre Capoli's Christmas special rules have been. <laughs> on the floor <laughs> dead um but we did actually have christmas special before this we had of course we had the first doctor christmas special which was a kind of a mayor one as well apparently it was kind of an odd one it was in between them dalek's master plan um a lot of people do scrutinize me because of my facebook page i do say the daleks are the main monster in this one they're not technically the main monster in this single episode because there isn't a monster um, in this episode, it's just a um, plain normal one, just for the companions. And the Doctor says Merry Christmas to the camera. And the people are like, he's going a bit cuckoo. And they're just like, all right, then let him go on a bit. So that's another one. Um, meh. That's a problem with the Christmas specials is there hasn't been enough. But then again, another problem with the Christmas specials are because they're all modern. Because if they were in the past, they could have done something on the future with them. And, you know, made them a bit better. But because they have done a lot now in the future... You know, all those things have fallen away. There isn't nothing really to do Christmas on them anymore. There isn't going to be any Christmas monsters. The penny I had this year, the amount of things at Christmas is like a Christmas tree, like three ways in or something, and that's it. That's the only Christmas thing you're going to see. So it's kind of disappointing, but um, I hope the Christmas special will be good this year. My guessing is not, but then again, everyone said that, and now they're saying it's all good, so I'm kind of confused. Because one minute you're saying it's going to be rubbish, and then you now you're saying it's going to be good. Make your mind up. I've made my mind up. I don't think it's going to be that good. If it gets changed by watching it, then yes, cool. Don't change your mind, you know, because you say, oh, one minute I like it. No, sorry. One minute I don't like it. Now, I said I like the Husbands of the River song. I actually did like Husbands of the River song. I just didn't like the characters in it. Some of the characters was, was just stupid. Um which I didn't know why they were in there. Um, I, I like the Husband's River song. I won't admit it. But it was probably the best one that it has been for a while of Christmas special. So it's like this for me. It's like this. It's like up with day tenant, had a little bit of bumps. Then Matt Smith very far down. Pick up these straight down. And then I was calling myself back up. I feel like it might go up a really high again. So it could be one of those. Or it could be another one down. But then again, I've heard that Nardle won't, there won't be no information of how Nardle gets his boy back. It might be in series 10. So I've got to wait for that. Um, River Song won't be in it. I think River Song could appear in this, like maybe for a few seconds, you know, just to say, you know, Nardle needs some time, you know, he needs to get away from all this. Because where's Nardle? You know, maybe it it will actually start at the beginning of Husbands of River, the Husbands of River Song. Doctor comes, picks up Nardle. Maybe River Song won't even appear. You know, it, it just has him flying away from the planet or something. Nothing here, but I think it's going to be about this girl's character. Maybe he can turn into a ghost. You know, it, it, I think it's kind of obvious that's going to happen in this episode. A sort of. Then they're going to find a problem with the ghost or something, you know, the doctor's giving him powers. They're going to find a problem with the ghost or something, like Kryptonite or something, like Superman. And, the, you know, that will be it. And the, the bloke will, like, you know, you're going to defeat me. And the doctor somehow defeats him or Nardle defeats him accidentally. It'll be something stupid like that, like Nardle defeats him accidentally. Like he didn't realise it or the doctor does it and he, you know, does it properly. But, you know, he's going to get defeated, the bloke. Or he's going to be shown the ways of being good. So, that's it, basically. That's it. So, the bloke's going to get defeated. He's either going to be shown the ways of being good, or he's going to get defeated. That is the way of this. That's the way of Doctor Who all the time. 
just this. So thank you guys for watching. Remember to please leave a like, comment, subscribe. Until next time guys, thanks for watching. Bye for now, bye.